probably noticed, Classic Car Week is here and it's in full swing. Cars worth millions of dollars are pretty much everywhere, and we are just warming up. There are dozens of events planned for the week leading up to, of course, the big show on Sunday. Today, though, it was Concours on the Avenue in Carmel. Action News reporter Caitlin Conrad is live in Monterey in with one car that's making its U.S. debut. Caitlin? Aaron, I'm here at Auto Lux, and for the first time ever in the United States, people are getting to take a look at the Vici 6.2 Emperor. It is quite, uh, quite uh, impressive, the paint job that they have on this car. It is amazing, and the reason that it is here at Classic Car Week is because this is the place to be if you're a car enthusiast. Okay, uh, how many cylinders is this? Eight, eight cylinders. Ocean Avenue underwent a transformation for Concours on the Avenue. A left around. It just, it's just fun to, talking to be a very fun, festive atmosphere. You know, fun people. Cars from all different classes were driven in by their owners and parked along the Avenue so car enthusiasts could get a first-hand look at them. Uh, I like just the style and how they're how they're made, usually if they're old, they're like handmade. And I just like first how they're fast. There was a really cool sporty car that was an Acura. And you usually don't see Acuras like in a very like racing car, super cool like that. And I thought it was really cool. It looked like a Ferrari, but it was an Acura. Okay, now one more. And some of the vehicles were drawing more attention than others, like Steve McQueen's last special order Porsche, which is headed to auction this Saturday. It's a special car because it's a 930 Turbo Carrera, first series car, which has become quite rare and valuable in the market today. And next. Also at the event, Chad McQueen, who says the car meant a great deal to his dad, and so did the charity that will benefit from its sale. Uh, the Boys Republic that uh, Mike's going to give some love to when it sells is a place my dad grew up when he was abandoned. So it was close to him. And uh, yeah, we hope it brings a big sum for Mike and the boys. That auction, the auction for Steve McQueen's last special order Porsche, is scheduled for Saturday at the Hyatt. Dan, Aaron. All right, very good. Meantime, that uh, Diamora car that we showed you at 5 o'clock, look at this thing. It is, it is the first of 25 in a series. They're making each one to pair with a painting by a Thai artist, Master Lee Sundan. It's sold for $1.2 million. It is expected to go up in value. The hood alone yeah. took yeah, more than 300 man hours to complete. So, as if you're a collector, you're collecting that painting along with this car. And it's the first time ever if you're an art and a car collector, you get both. Get to hang it in the house and get to drive it. The body is carbon fire, fiber, making it uh, very, very light. There's a racing suspension underneath. The hood, well, underneath there is 430 horsepower. And gold, gold leaf. Tomorrow, the anticipated first ever car, first uh, car week auction on Cannery yeah. Row yeah. for JR Auctions takes place. Newcomer will be holding a waterfront event at the plaza.